Hello everyone, in this video we are giving this interesting problem. a plus b is equal to 10, a squared plus b squared is equal to 58, and we are to find the value of a to the third power plus b to the third power. Before we start, if you are new here, please subscribe to my channel and also don't forget to like this video. Now let's get started. For this question to be very simple for us, we need to figure one algebraic identity. If we know this algebraic identity, that is a plus b all to the third power, then this question becomes nothing, right? If we expand this one based on the identity, we are going to have a to the third power plus b to the third power plus three times a b times a plus b. If we know this identity, the question is nothing. What we need to do is to figure out what a plus b is, or a b, and then a plus b, then we are good to go. So let's call this equation, equation one, and then call this equation, equation two. So from equation one, let's cube each side of the equation so that we get a plus b, or cube, is equal to 10 cube. If we expand this one, we are going to get the exact same thing here. So let me copy this down. And this is equal to 10 cube, which is 1000. This is what we are looking for. So let's go ahead and then make it the subject. So we have a cube plus b cube is equal to 1000 minus the whole of this 3ab a plus b very simple now what is ab and then what is a plus b for a plus b we know that from equation 1 to be 10 right now what is ab if we find ab then the question is solved already right now to get a b let's go ahead and then square equation one right this equation let's square it so that we get a b squared is equal to 10 squared now if we expand the left hand side we're going to be getting a squared plus b squared plus 2 a b and this is equal to 10 squared which is 100. Now we know a squared plus b squared from equation 2 to be 58, right? So we're going to be getting the whole of this is 58. So we're going to have 58 plus 2ab is equal to 100. Now let's transpose the 58 so that we get 2ab is equal to 100 minus 58. So we have 2ab is equal to 42. We are looking for ab, so let's divide through by 2. So that this and this will go. Now we have ab is equal to 21. So let's go back to our equation. This is the equation. I should have named it already, right? Let's call it equation star. So now we know ab to be 21 and then a plus b to be 10 so let's go ahead and then plug these values into equation star so that we get a cube plus b cube is equal to 1000 minus 3 times a b which is 21 times a plus b which is also 10 from equation 1 now let's simplify this so as always, I'm going to copy this down because this is what we are looking for. We have 1,000. Now, 3 times 21, we're going to have 3 times 1, which is 3. Then 3 times 2, that is 6. Then 10. I'm going to bring 0 here so that we get 660. Now, I don't have a calculator here, so let me solve it manually. So we're going to have 1,000 minus 630 
And if you simplify this, you are getting zero. Then we're gonna borrow one from here, making this one 10. Then we will borrow one again, making here 10 and then here nine, right? 10 minus three, that is seven. Then we borrowed one from this 10, so we are left with nine here. Nine minus six is three. So basically, this is the answer that we are getting. A cube plus B cube is 370. So guys, this is the final answer. I hope you found this video useful. Please give it a thumbs up and also don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Thanks again for watching and see you again on the next video. Take care. Bye-bye.